The Monkey and the Wooden Peg Once upon a time, the construction work of a big temple was going on in full swing near a city. A large number of laborers were engaged in that construction work. Due to abundance of wood work there, there were more laborers to saw wood. There were wooden logs scattered all around. The work of sawing logs and beams was going on there. All the laborers always had to go to the city to have lunch. When all the laborers went to the city to have lunch, there was no one there. Once it was time to eat, all the workers left their work and went to eat. There a wooden log was left split in half. The worker had stuck a nail in that half-cut wooden log. The worker did this so that when the work started again, the saw could be easily inserted into it. At that time a group of monkeys came jumping there. There was also a mischievous monkey in that group who kept teasing everything without any reason. Doing all kinds of mischief had become a habit of his. The king of that group of monkeys ordered everyone that no one should touch the things lying there. As per the king's order, all the monkeys turned towards the trees. But that mischievous monkey saved himself from everyone's sight and remained near the wooden log lying there and started teasing the logs lying there. Suddenly the monkey's eyes fell on the half-cut wooden log lying there. He sat on that log and started looking at the nail placed in the middle of the log. While looking at the ford, his eyes fell on the saw kept there. He picked up the saw and started rubbing it on the wood lying there. When the saw was rubbed with wood, it started making kier kier sounds. When he heard this sound, he got angry and threw the saw on the spot. The sound of kiruru kiruru means nikatu in the language of monkeys. Then he started looking back at the nail stuck between the same log. While watching this, a curiosity arose in his mind that what would happen if this nail was taken out from the middle of this wooden log. That mischievous monkey started using his force to take out the nail. The nail stuck between the logs is held very firmly between the two legs, because the two legs of the log hold it down like a cliff with a very strong spring. That evil monkey used all his strength to shake it. When the nail was applied hard, it started moving and the monkey was happy to see his strength and started moving the nail with force. During this wrestling match, the monkey's tail had come between the two legs of the wooden log, which the monkey did not realize. While doing this he got excited and gave a strong blow. As soon as the blow was applied, the nail came out and the two cut parts were joined like a clip and the monkey's tail came between these two parts. The monkey shouted loudly. Then it was time for the workers to return. He saw the workers coming and tried to run away. Due to excessive force his tail broke. He ran away screaming, carrying his broken tail. Learning from the story. From this story we learned that we should neither tamper with the things of others nor interfere in their work. By doing this we only suffer loss.